You know, unfortunately right now I can't really comment until everything is resolved. Um, you know, obviously I regret the fact that anything happened uh, at all and uh, just have to kind of wait for a while. I haven't really talked to anybody, I've been just been quiet. The finale for us, uh, Jack goes through a real transformation as a character. Uh, he really is a very, very different guy at the end of this season than from the very beginning of season one. Uh, and I think that that's interesting from a character's point of view and certainly for an actor to play that's been very exciting. Uh, but it's also balanced beautifully with this kind of fantastic drama and everything is kind of come to an end. I don't want to give away too much and I know that's annoying because everyone's so excited to see it. And I'm excited because I haven't seen it. So this is a really big night, not just for the you know 900 people that are going to be here, but for me. Because I worked so hard in these last two episodes. My character has like gone through the ringer and it's just, it was so much fun to do. So I can't wait to see how it turned out. I did the scariest stunts of my life. Life. Oh yeah, like what? You can't tell me. I get really hot. You so, get really hot. So yeah. Maybe. Perhaps. Maybe. Perhaps. Maybe. <laughs> um, I think that's fantastic. Uh, one of the great things for us this last season was to be able to use Washington D.C. as a backdrop, and just inherently it changed the energy of the show. Uh, and New York has probably got more energy than any city in the world, and, and so it'll be great to be able to feed off of that. We're so excited to have him as an actor, and we've, we, you know, we had such a fantastic cast this year, uh, and we, we really aim to kind of try and fill every role with the best actors we can possibly find, and so we're thrilled about him. Uh, but he, he uh, is wonderful kind of in the political, he's a very strong aspect of the political storyline for next year. I know that he's the president of a, you know, of a, um, you know, a fictitious country and that's all I really know. I know, I know some stuff comes out about Renee's past, has something to do with the crisis. I don't know what that means <laughs> and I'm excited to find out.